the Back to Clear 2 litre Ward Liner. For this you will need one 2 litre Back to Clear Ward canister with rear vacuum port, one 2 litre Back to Clear Ward liner with a unique smooth surface for ease of cleaning. Note first the patient port and then the vacuum port. These are unique and cannot be misconnected. Taking the yellow non-disposable vacuum tubing, insert the T-piece vacuum connector located within the tubing kit itself and press firmly into the port situated at the back of the canister. Start by placing the 2 litre canister into the wall bracket. Place the back to clear liner into the canister and press home firmly. Connect the black vacuum tapered connector into the vacuum port located on the liner lid. Turn on the vacuum to high and inflate the liner within the canister. Place your finger over the patient port located on the lid of the liner ensuring a vacuum is present. Connect the patient tubing to the patient port. The suction unit is now ready for use. Once the liner is full and with the vacuum still turned on, remove the patient tubing, twist off the black cap located on the front edge of the liner top and insert firmly into the patient port. Remove the vacuum tapered connector from the top of the liner, remembering that there is no requirement to cap off the vacuum port. This is due to the hydrophobic filter located within the liner itself. Using the convenient handles located at the sides of the liner, remove the liner from the canister. The Vaxax Back to Clear antimicrobial liners stand upright when full of fluid for convenient and safe disposal.